Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I am an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we're going to continue mapping out or uncovering the fog of war, I should say, on the new territory and just checking it out some more. Uh, so last night, uh, I left you guys over here-ish, and I just followed the fence line all the way down to here, um, swam the lake, the fence line on the lake, and then went, went up. Oh, there's our second attack. Wound up back here. So that this is the extreme western uh, and northern end of uh, this new territory. So we still have all this area to look at here. A couple of little um, fog of war spots to unlock there, and then some area along here too. Um, in the process of doing that, we're looking for a locked crate. We do have one thingy here, and uh, continuing to, to uh, work on nails. Okay, so I've got some meat that's probably going to go off here pretty soon. Uh, so let's just chow down on some of that. And once it goes bad, it goes bad. It's not a big deal. Uh, we are a little bit low on carbs, so that'll that'll give us some back. We have 13 water, so hopefully we can run across some blueberries uh, or, you know, some carrots or potatoes or whatever to eat along the way. Uh, otherwise, carbs might start to become a little bit of an issue, but uh, it's not going to kill us. Well, I shouldn't say that. Maybe it will, because if we run out of carbs, <laughs> our stamina will tank. Stamina regen will tank, but we'll do the best we can. Okay, so let's run up here. Oh, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, my goodness, that's beautiful. That is just absolutely gorgeous. Okay, let's grab this. Um, there's some carbs there that we can mix into berry water. And um, I'm going to take it right now because again we need it for carbs more than hydration and then uh, let's look at the map again so yeah we want to kind of cut across through here i'm not really worried about those two little spots there uh we're just going to pretty much go to the northwest until we get to here and then we'll start kind of cutting up this way all right that's the plan let's do it we are looking for nails ladies and gentlemen Yes, indeed we are. Ah, there's a strawberry. We need to make room for that. Oh, I guess we have room for that. Can you make strawberry water? Nope. <laughs> Too bad. Okay, we're not eating the strawberries. We need. We want to save those for jam. Um, So, yeah, we'll do that. Coming around through here. Got the nice little stream running down into the lake. Okay, here we go. We got a building crate here. We're up to 27 nails. Beautiful. Um, there's actually a pretty decent portion of this lake available, but I, you know, I dove under the water. I didn't go all the way bottom, of course, <clears throat> but I dove under the water and um, it basically is just one big deep canyon. Um, and not not quite as many, I don't know, features I guess as the the finished lakes. But again, this is a work in progress and. Things will change with it in the future. Okay, so where are we at now? We want to actually go more this way because we've already been out on that peninsula there. We'll head towards this grub tree. Keep our eyes peeled for more loot crates. There's chicken, another chicken. Here's a potato. Okay, is that an actual potato potato? No, it's a seed. Okay. Um... Are we willing to give anything up for a potato seed? Ah, uh, can we eat one more of those? Yeah, I'm gonna throw that liver out because it is about ready to go off. I did find one potassium node last night too, which is great. So we now have some potassium and we continue to find iron, which is always good. Always a good thing. Okay, so we'll keep looking for those crates. I think we were uh, sort of over in this area yesterday, but further up that way. Okay, so we actually want to go this way to finish uncovering that, that portion of the map. Okay, we got an ammo crate here. Up to 30 nails, good. We're getting there. We are getting there. I think I've told you guys this before, but the 
I think the best nail day, single day of looting nail day I've ever had in this game. I got something like 109 or 19, something like that. Um, and that was a good day. Yes, indeed it was. All right, I don't want to mess, waste my ammo on that black bear, so let's just run straight through. If he chases us, he chases us. The rock formations look a little different through here, which is interesting. Something different. Do we have a bear and a wolf chasing us? Okay, there's a crate up ahead. Don't make me turn around, bear. If you're still on me by the time I get to this crate, you are dead. You know what? Screw you. You're dead anyway. I don't have time for this. Okay. Let's butcher the bar. And he doesn't give a shit for, for loot. Um, okay, we can take that. I really I'm a I'm like really low on cloth. Can I Alright, hold on. Let's do something here real quick. Here's what we're gonna do. We are going to temporarily throw this out. We're gonna make one of these. We're gonna make two oh no let's make another another one of these i'm get, basically getting rid of these feathers here by making them into arrows rather than just chucking them normally i wouldn't worry about it so much for cloth but like i said i'm super low on cloth oh you know what we need to watch the decay time on these if i don't think i'm going to make it back in time we'll just have to consume those okay now let's pick this back up and we should be able to grab the cloth out of you. Oh, wait a minute. What did I do wrong? Oh, something just went off. That's what. Okay. Alrighty. So, let's see. Let's take a look at our map here. Yeah, so we unlocked all of that area there. We Now we want to kind of start heading northeast and cut through up here. So, basically this way. And we have um, a more iron. Okay. How much iron do we have now? 29. Okay, that's not bad. That is not bad. So we're just going to kind of stay along this side of this crick here. And enjoy the scenery. Uh, do I have room for copper? I do. Okay, let's grab it. Sounds like we got a storm coming in. All right. It's a neat looking area up and through there. Oh, shit. You know what? This guy's probably going to hassle us too. We might as well deal with him as well. Only takes two shots for a level one. Okay, boys, give us some more fat and cloth. There's no cloth in there, but there's some fat. That's probably a steak, right? Yeah. Can't can't pick it up, unfortunately. I guess what we could do though. I hate wasting stuff in this game. I really, really hate wasting stuff in this game. Uh, let's throw you back out for a minute. And we're just going to eat you. I have no way of knowing which piece of meat is close to going off and which one isn't. There's there's no way to know that. So we'll just eat that one. It's better than throwing it away. Let's move up through here. There's some more scrap over there. Now, this could completely be my imagination, or maybe just the RNG for the day, but it does seem like there are fewer crates in this area than in the other areas. More potassium. Beautiful. 
take that. More iron. Also beautiful. And more iron again. We're going to come back with a nice old pile of iron. I'm okay with that, man. I am okay with that. Anything up there? Yeah, there's a crate. These medicinal crates uh, in particular. Okay, we're not going to be able to get that arrow, so... Or, I'm sorry, feather. We're going to have to let it go. I got tons of feathers anyways. Uh, I was going to say the medicinal crates are the ones that are the hardest to spot because they're green, so they're more camouflaged than the other ones are. Well, the building crates are kind of camouflaged too, actually. A couple bears that way, a bear that way, wolves up this way. They're all over the place. Why don't we cut across here? Got a little island in the stream there. That's neat. Also a good song, too. Oh, let's try and avoid the bear. The whooshing sound is just meat going bad. Oh, that gets us right up to the fence line. Okay. Yeah, I see you, bear. Go away. Leave me alone. I don't want to waste ammo on your ass. So we came down off the edge of that last night. Okay, let's take a look and see what we're doing. All right, now let's just kind of cut across to the east to uncover this part. The headwaters. Kind of a neat little spot. Got some scrap up here. And a bunny. Waskily Wabbit. Getting a decent amount of scrap from this trip, too. What are we up to on scrap? Ten? Oh, well, that's okay. I thought I had more than that, but maybe not. little copper action over here. These new rocks don't seem to be textured as... Uh, it seems like they have a lower res texture than the normal ones. I don't know. I don't know. I think I have the graphics maxed out on this game for my computer. I haven't looked at that in a long, long time. Okay, more ores here. This pick is about ready to break. I'm going to go ahead and just let it break because of the inventory space. And I have another one. Whoop. What? Give me that back. Yeah, I don't know. It seems like this maybe isn't rendering correctly or something. It's a little bit weird. A little bit weird, man. A little bit weird. Okay. Let's take a look at our map now. Now, we missed a little spot back up that way. You know what? I don't think it matters because that's just snowfield and there isn't going to be anything there anyway. Let's, let's confirm that, but I'm pretty sure that that's the case. There's an eagle over that way. Yeah, that's just this, this cliff here. So, yeah, we're good. We're good. So, let's uh, go grab this scrap over here and then take a look at the map and see which direction we want to go in next we'll go to the edge of this cliff here kind of look out over that area which is neat i th think that's a medicinal bag down there or a crate down there all right so why don't we go north and then kind of cut down this way and then head south to start 
uncovering more of this and we'll just kind of circle back up and around that way uh, but I am going to grab this crate though oh look at that that appeared right in front of our face cool so we're up to 31 nails now I'm not making huge progress on the nails, but we're doing the best we can, man. We're doing the best we can. Okay, so this gets us to the border of this fence. Uh, let's go a little bit further down this way. Oh, this is... Okay, so this is where it actually curves around and starts heading back into this area. Okay. That was closer than I thought we were to it. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. So what we'll do then is we'll... Uh, let's get at the corner here. If we look that way... Yeah, this is all of the old map. Probably this whole area here. So let's just go south... Maybe a little bit southeast-ish. Uh, or, I'm sorry, southwest-ish. And we'll just kind of do a straight line down through here, back into the new territory. Because everything off to my left is original, is original map. Well, again, when I say original map, what we've had before the update. That's cordage. Yeah, we're going to let that go. I think. Are we? You know what? These strawberries are going to go off. Let's just eat them. We'll grab the cordage. There's no way I'm going to get those strawberries back in time. Looks like we have some ore over here. Man, we are really hitting the iron this time around. I love it. Okay, we got a wolf that way, south, southwest. Let's go around this big rock formation. And just pretty much straight this way, I think. So I think this is more or less where the fence line used to run. Is that a crate? Yeah, that is a crate. Let's go get it. Maybe the... It might have been a little further that way, actually. I'm trying to remember. Okay, so... We're going to have to make some decisions now. This is easily gotten. We're going to take the blueberries and do this. And we're going to consume that. And we're going to grab the cotton plant seed. And the ash is going to have to go bye-bye. Would have been nice to hang on to it, but at this point in the in the uh, situation, uh, we got to start making sacrifices because we just ran out of space. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, if I remember right, the fence line, I think, ran kind of along down through here uh, before the expansion. It seems to me like that's, you know, because I remember coming off that mountain one time I think we were on, uh, on the hang glider, in fact, and we're kind of following the fence along this way. That might not be 100% accurate, but I think we're in, definitely in the right neck of the woods, at least. Shut up, wolf. Oh, we got a moose. Mr. Moose. So let's just kind of follow along up through here. We got waterfalls all over the place. That's kind of neat. I am curious if we go chicken, a chicken on a mountain. Look at that. That's a mountain chicken, everybody. So there's quite a sizable snow field up here, actually. If we look back down that way. Okay, so yeah, that's still looking into the new territory. I wonder if you could cross the mountains over here to get 
to the other side. Or if there's going to be a fence. I'm just curious. We'll see. It does look like that's the case. Yeah, um, it looks like this is all accessible now up here. Not that there's anything up here, at least not yet. You should add, like, polar bears to the game or snow leopards or something. That'd be cool. Yeah, that drops back down into that area. All right, cool. Very cool. Almost looks like there's a little pathway up to the mountain there. Okay, let's head back this direction. And we have our third attack. All right, let's look at the map here. Uh, there's a little spot up here we missed. Uh, and that's north. So I'm going to go uncover that real quick. Looks like we have some ore over here anyways that we can grab. We have a level one brownie. Let's get him. Yeah, I know. You already told me my base was under attack. Okay, what is this? That is liver. Why don't we throw that out for a minute, grab this, eat it. This is fun, man. Hope you guys are enjoying uh, these, these last two exploration episodes. And probably most of you, if not all of you watching, have either been in this territory yourself or maybe you watched somebody else do it. But this is the first time... I've really looked at it, you know, other than that one time in the winter at nighttime, way back when the update first came out. So I'm enjoying it. Okay, we got to go down through here. We got a level three brownie there. Let's just run away from him. There's a grub tree over that way. Okay, so does that get us to the spot that we needed to uncover? Uh, a little bit up on this rock here. Or near the rock, anyway. Excellent. Okay, let's um, shoot down through here and get that part uncovered. We'll go around this way to avoid the bear. That's the big pond. Okay, this wolf's going to be a pain in our butt. Make up your mind, wolf. Let's eat that liver. And hey, you might as well eat that piece of meat, too. We're, get, uh, we're kind of low on carbs, but what can you do, right? Oh, there we go. Okay. Let me check the map again. A 
Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to cut down this way. I keep thinking, oh, there's a strawberry. We need that. Um, okay, let's throw you out for a second, grab the berry, eat it. There we go. Okay, that gave us a little bit of a carb boost. There's a bear over that way. We get to some more of these weird rocks. Level one brownie. That's a liver. We could probably eat another liver. There we go. Okay. Um, all right. It's, I think it's, we're starting to lose daylight again. So I'm trying to decide, do I want to go back up through here or finish? Yeah. You know what? I think I'm going to go back up through here, uncover this, wrap back around, and then kind of hit this area. And then we've, I think we've pretty much got it. I mean, I'm not really too terribly worried about these tiny little fog of war areas. Um, so, yeah, let's do that. Let's turn north and go back this way and just kind of get the rest of this little area uncovered while avoiding level three bears. I don't think we're being pursued. Okay, let's open this. 59 nails. All right. If we are fortunate enough when we get home to not have massive damage on the base, we still could. That's just rotten meat, potentially. Sounded like that bear was on to us. have 300 nails or close enough to it to where we're going to we're going to build no matter what Oh my goodness it is dark Okay Well my friends it is that time once again for me to let you go Um so again Here let's get down here for a second Um The plan is that I'm just I'm going to uncover this and then, you know, uncover this last little patch here. Continue to hit nails. You know, it, it's interesting. We haven't found a single locked crate over here. So, yeah, that's that's a thing. Um, and then I'm going to work my way back home. I'll I'll keep my, my finger on the record button in case something crazy happens. But if nothing crazy happens, I'll probably just meet you guys back at our base in the next episode. Where we will, uh, no matter how many nails we have... <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna we want I want to get going on the building. So that is the plan So hope you guys enjoyed uh, this episode and if you did please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel Leave a comment and share the video and we will catch you in the next episode. Okay, let's go on a night Expedition here. Hopefully we don't get it. Bye guys